hello traders it's samurai trader here welcome to this training video how to trade the 2b strategy this is a general public video so there are going to there or there is going to be at the start a very short advertisement with for what I do in my course and you know please sit through that because this is probably one of the most important videos I've produced in years the 2b strategy uh, is absolutely kicking butt it works on any market virtually any time frame uh, it's, it's just working brilliantly and it will always work brilliantly because of the methodology and the trend following strategy behind it it is a butt kicker okay this truly is in this statement I've got here your ticket to financial freedom whether or not you become a member of mine or invest in my program it doesn't matter uh, for the experienced traders looking at what I'm about to show you you'll understand probably a lot of what I'm about to show you you'll, you'll go aha now I see it because today traders I'm going to show you uh, some charts I'll show you some setups and I'll explain a lot of what we do I'm not going to give the complete secret source away unless you remember but I promise you I will give you a huge amount of value in this recording so it doesn't matter whether you trade stocks Forex all time frames the strategies work now I know that over 80% of you watching this video will be experienced traders many of you because you're still searching uh, for a strategy or a system or a methodology probably that's why you're on the internet uh, have probably had a hard time up till now over 80% I've got over 5,000 members now and over 80% are experienced traders and I just want to say this you can't go back and change the beginning that is if trading's been tough for you up till now okay today is a new day but you can start where you are and change the ending I love this statement is you can draw a line in the sand and we can approach trading differently because what I'm about to show you today will mean a paradigm shift for many of you it truly will so I recommend uh, pause the video if you don't have a pen and uh, pad handy please pause the video and get one very very important that you do uh, yes I'll go through a bit of waffle to begin with but it's important that I lay some groundwork then we'll get down to the nitty-gritty but some very very important stuff here as always I do need to put up the risk uh, disclaimer there is a risk in trading don't trade with the rent money in actual fact I'd ask you to pause the video and just have a read of the disclaimer perhaps is a better way of putting it but very very quick advertisement then we'll get into the real content if you don't already have my free training manual uh, please visit my website uh, there's two free manuals that I have I've just got the uh, the uh, ebook for truth about day trading uh, make sure you download those get get a copy of those even more importantly subscribe to my YouTube you, let me get that out right YouTube channel everything I'm about to show you today by the way traders for hundred and ninety seven dollars you receive all of the setups uh, indicators that I have for ninja trader trade station you, you receive the indicators that for, for some of those we've just got the very basic ones that you'll see today uh, so uh, they're all included there's over 300 training videos it's actually now over 300 hours of online video instruction uh, it's a world it truly is the world's most comprehensive program out there for a few hundred dollars you know it's a program that every trader must have and and Siri if you're serious about trading and you don't have my program shame on you <laughs> that's what I'm almost gonna say anyway traders that's the end of the advertisement but please subscribe to my channel visit my website get my program and you'll just see and perhaps what I'm about to show you will give you an idea how comprehensive this is so let's get into it all right first of all I've got to say this masterpieces take time traders I'm amazed every day I received emails or receive emails around the world from traders majority of them wanting really an easy ride they want to be able to pick it up and they want to be day trading or swing trading within days profitably you know we've got to remember when we're trading we're trading against some of the best minds in the world 
you know thankfully thankfully for me <laughs> day trading is not about intellect it truly isn't it's about understanding the patterns the patterns that we see in the market each and every day but you need to give yourself 90 to 180 days to get this down pat you've got to master it on the simulator before you go live if you're looking for a quick fix uh, unless you're already a very experienced trader where you'll pick up uh, a lot of the strategies that I teach very very quickly you know it you've got to give yourself at 90 days you put yourself under unfair pressure and you will make mistakes which in the end causes that psychological damage when it comes to real trading so it's very very important you take the time and I'm not sure if I mentioned at the start of this video traders but uh, I'm running this this is un, uh, unedited and unscripted so if I fluff up on the way through and make a few mistakes on grammar or whatever you'll just have to forgive me now a very very important thing here is as we get in and in a few minutes when we go to the charts stop looking for the reasons why these strategies don't work focus on the reasons why they do work and unfortunately experienced traders can become so skeptical that they throw the, the baby out with the bathwater right they miss out on the important information so please be very very careful of that because mindset is truly everything when it comes to trading and in my coaching and with my own members as I teach them to be asking intelligent compelling questions such as what I'm about to show you today traders how can I want you to be asking yourself how can I use this to improve my trading if you're already experienced what's great about this then when you look at that when you look at your own trading perhaps even the mistakes you make what will I do differently next time what can I learn from this how can I improve my entry how can I improve my exit notice the presupposition of most of these questions it can be improved and when it comes to trading trading is 90% psychology it really is and it will make a massive difference if you approach it with the the right mindset because I can give you the world's best strategies but if you suffer from what I call stinking thinking all right you sunk from day one in fact I teach traders particularly in my when I have my private coaching clients a daily report card you know what are my thoughts and feelings about today and this is a project at the end of each day to invest 15 to 30 minutes at the end of each day doing this you've got to remember traders that winning traders are willing to do the things that losing traders won't do most losing traders are not willing to fill out a daily report card for themselves they're not willing to take the time and they wonder why they're not improving so what you've got before you is the greatest income opportunity of anything that I know of in the world you can start literally with a thousand dollars and build from there yes I know you might have to start with a micro account trading FX or a mini but you can build it up and you can take it from there and that really leads me into the next thing which is really important it's very important that you develop and you have what we call a compelling future uh, you've got to have a reason for doing it when I deal with traders as I talk to them you know I want to find out what's really important what's what you know what's their future what are their goals because let me ask you this what would you attempt to do if you knew you could not fail let me say that again slower what would you attempt to do if you knew you could not fail it would be huge and so what I'm about to show you I want you to have that mindset because you can do this okay so this is a chant <laughs> it's actually a, a chant is an incantation okay an incantation uh, if you look up the proper dictionary meaning of, of that an incantation is a spell okay and we have with um, uh, my coaching clients we've got this thing where we go five by five yes I can five by five yes I can three by eight yes I can now before you think I've lost my marbles there's a reason for this we get in state for trading okay you've got to have the right mindset and what this means is five by five in this particular table we're talking about trading CL oil the black gold uh, it's a little bit different as we'll see on the next slide if you're trading the ES and you just simply ad ad adapt it because with CL it's ten dollars a tick so five by five means five trades by fifty dollars each that's what we call scalps five quick scalps less commissions is around the 220 230 mark 
the two B's which we're going to be talking a lot more about today is three by eight because you tend to get um, a larger profit target with the two B's and on CL the uh, eight to ten tick per trade is like the sweet spot it's a really good one so we got this thing five by five yes I can and uh, some of our members have even um, uh, recorded over the Queens uh, we will rock you anyway I won't get into that right now <laughs> to digress but it's fantastic trading is about mindset now if you love the ES or an, even if you're on Forex okay I'm a standard lot the last table is applicable uh, if you trade ES all right five by five is is fifty dollars is a sweet little scalp four ticks five ticks you'll probably find actually five ticks is is perfect with the CL sorry with the ES on scalping and six to eight is perfect with the two B's and it works really well and here is why that's relevant one of the important things is that you have a goal in mind what's your daily target now if you're a member this is if you're a member watching this and a new member if you haven't seen it already on the on my Google Drive there's a folder there with the compound table so you can download this Excel spreadsheet and you can play around with the contract value your investment and your daily target and that will then give you this overall figure so very quickly if you started with five thousand dollars capital with a maximum of a two percent risk okay very important is our risk management all right there are old traders there are bold traders there are no old bold traders meaning if you want to stay in this business long term you don't want to be bold okay you've got to be conservative you've got to approach trading with the right mindset and one of those of course is money management a maximum risk in your early days of 2% and preferably lowering that over time but anyway if you were to trade futures I would recommend the starting balance of 5,000 yes I know some of you will say look I've been told 2,000 well if you've got a tiny stop that's okay but if you've got a stop of 80 to 100 dollars what's two percent okay that's um, uh, two percent of 80 to 100 is 1.75 to two percent of 5,000 uh, very important but anyway if you started with 5,000 and your average net at the end of the day was 200 a day in which we do need to go for 300 a day to achieve that there's a minimum okay but our net target is and I'm going to show you how to do this today by the way so yes but at the end of a week you want to have a thousand dollars in the bank and every time you double your your account or you double your money so you go from uh, five to ten thousand you start trading two contracts okay so Monday week we're trading two then when you get up to fifteen thousand you start trading three contracts and you build from there and it basically comes down within 16 weeks you're earning over ten thousand dollars a week within 16 weeks that's on 200 a day now before your eyes cloud over and you say I can't do this watch yourself talk you can do this with the right training with the right mindset be very careful of your self-talk traders this is one of the things in dealing with my members straight away watch yourself talk now yes you may have to all right you may be it's no good being uh, a, a confident incompetent fool okay that's what it makes you you've got to be confident and competent at the same time and you do that through simulation and mastering the techniques over a period of time but this is a realistic possibility what if you go up to 300 a day and I'm going to show you how to do that in a moment okay look look at this here within all right 10 weeks you're on or actually within nine weeks you're on your 10,000 a week this is the possibility of this I recommend and of course if you're a member watching this uh, if you're a member watching this actually it should be ad free okay but if you're uh, if you become a member get this uh, the, the um, Excel spreadsheet print out these pages you know set a goal whether it be a hundred or five hundred a day whatever it is once you get up and I'm not going to go above 300 a day because it just gets crazy I mean you can really compound their returns incredibly now let me also give you a, a very quick um, thing while we're on that now I'm recording this at uh, 1356 uh, in the afternoon my time 
so this makes this the globex session and we'll see this on the charts realistically if you're trading any more than about 10 contracts on the ES or, or on the black gold on oil you're going to start to get slippage fortunately in the after hours market you can nearly always use a limit order okay because it's ticking away fairly quietly but you still got some really healthy volume on ES and even gold you can do really well on gold in the after hours market when you look at the NQ or YM one or two contracts is about the maximum you can realistically trade but another thing traders is this after 6 p.m. Eastern the, the market so the market closes and then it reopens at 6 p.m. Eastern and you've it's called the Globex market there's some fantastic trading yes it's slower it's a lot slower however if you're a newer trader or you need to retrain yourself or re or resharpen your skills or whatever it is a great market to trade as you're about to see and you don't need a lot of trades and realistically you can really um, uh, you, you can realistically trade the ES with, with just the two B's as I'm about to show you you can trade the ES and the CL you could trade both of them realistically if you start to build some of the other setups that we have in it might become a little more difficult for a newer trader but you can trade a couple of markets during the New York session or even leading into the London session you really got to focus on one market but even more importantly once again as a new trader start with one market and build from there anyway back onto this trading is nothing more than a pattern solving exercise the market has a memory we see the same patterns in every market day in and day out so what I'm going to be sharing with you they're patterns they're patterns that we see every single day now when you become a member you get um, it's a massive program there's a ton of setups I think there's over 15 16 setups now okay we've got what we call the rule of one for Renko charts rule of two for range we've got the super scalp you got the 21 B 34 B 89 we've got the slingshot so um, uh, which absolutely kicks butt as you're about to see the t7 which is a double bottom double top with the with the trend and what we call bet the farm because it's a very very high probability then we've got the 2b and it can be a 3b you can use multiple time frames when it comes to change of trend we've got um, a three I have three main strategies and counter trend uh, which you you put on ice until you master trading with the trend okay very important but I'm going to be showing you a couple of strategies or a couple of setups that, that it's just it just kicks butt for an example if we look at the ES today so on the ES where is it here have I got it here uh, oh no on CL for an example on CL today and you'll see this one to go to the charts in a moment one two three four five six seven there were seven two or three D's seven uh, and for seven winners okay it just kicks butt uh, that was yesterday sorry today there was one two three four five six seven eight nine ten uh, there were eight by eight plus ticks and there were two by seven ticks and I don't think there was a, a, a loss there so you can do very very well but it does take a little more skill set to learn and in the end traders you need to develop what I call the sniper mentality unfortunately we as traders we have this hunter mentality built into us we want to go out there and hunt I believe it's uh, uh, just something within us all very very important we learn to sit back and wait in patience and there's a whole lot of slides that I show members on that but we won't get into it now but you've got to develop the mindset of the sniper very very important traders so and as I say here yes I've got 15 plus strategies but become a specialist focus on only two or two or four, sorry two or four three or four strategies until you are consistently profitable and in fact some of the strategies I'm going to show you they're all um, most of them a trend continuation they work hand in hand so uh, and if you remember listening oh that's right I've got a slide showing you this in a moment anyway but we've got the 2b the t1 the 34b and the t2 all work together beautifully now this is what we're looking to do the dark blue line is our higher time frame okay now I bring this up and sometimes I've been in live audiences where 
you know I see some people they look away and oh yeah here we go again trading with the overall trend but what's really interesting is usually we hear that from uh, losing traders or traders that are not making money if you truly want to master the art of the of, of day trading or swing trading what is the higher time frame doing it's very very important traders that we trade in the direction of a higher time frame what we're doing on our lower time frame we're we're uh, buying the pullbacks okay so we get a pullback a retracement and we buy in the direction of our anchor chart it will make a massive difference now remember in the end traders we only need five by five yes I can three by eight yes I can so I automatically get in the chant <laughs> because that ain't many trades and so for my members watching the t1 t2 and the 34b that's your five by five your 2b is your 3 by 8 and you're there there is what 400 a day per contract now up here I'm showing you the potential of just 300 a day now what if all of a sudden you get up to 400 for somebody that's trading three to four hours a day this is the realistic achievable target on say CL or ES uh, each day or an active market this is the potential if you're trading the ES if you're focusing on that okay you want four to five four or five tick trades a day six tick trades a day and you're about to see this on the charts the potential in doing this how realistic this is now very quickly I'm going to show you just now very quick a couple of testimonials in a way but now this is not to say hey go and buy my program what this is this is what members are achieving or how they're doing and some of them are new and just where they're going with their personal trading uh, I love this one and this is more of a one <laughs> um, uh, John John Hull one of my uh, members sent me this at Christmas time and he found this sweet baby raise raise secret sauce okay and I think John was referring to the 2b were you John I think you were one swig is part of your hour of power and that the hour of power is what I say to every trader particularly my coaching clients so I've got a lot of full-time traders is we have what we call the hour of power before kicking off trading five by five you bet your secret sauce I can laughing out loud okay just um, a funny thing but it's really true okay getting in the right mindset just um, here uh, Andrews target 700 per contract uh, trading uh, the 34 B's uh, the, the t2s the, the double tops double bottoms and the two B's together um, uh, this is a member here that's been a member for, for a number of years now uh, <laughs> we just hadn't spoken uh, for a while and this was in August uh, I follow the gold every day change my trade about 500 uh, percent Dave from Seattle his name is uh, here uh, here are two B's 34 B's t2's kicking butt another client that's gone now this is a client from uh, trading with his live account uh, this does work and we we're just laughing about this in a coaching session once is that uh, you know I get you know traders will say the strategies don't work well crap traders the fact is if these don't work for you you're just not trying hard enough you're not willing to put the effort in and, and let me say this again and I know some people get peeved with me and won't become members because I talk direct but the bottom line is the only place in the world where success comes before work is in the dictionary you've got to put the screen time in to learn the strategies they're not complicated they're ABC if you can learn to drive a car in 30 days you can learn these within 30 days you've just got to develop what I call reflex action which will take you 90 right these strategies work and I just smirk you know we we're just talking about it live how some people will complain and bitch but they're not willing to put the work in and that's the bottom line you can learn these they they ain't rocket science now this is an interesting one now once again this is about giving you confidence as a trader this is a member uh, his name's Ashley Mulk actually and he's he's coded uh, some of my strategies and with my permission I'm allowing him to sell the the, um, uh, the, the program uh, and at the moment he's coded it for the t2 and the, the 2b uh, sorry the t2 and the 34b but um, and so he's approached me about selling this in I think November and just very quickly I just wanted to show you this now I'm not going to the screenshots but the t2 is killing at the moment 
uh, on the uh, what's the six the six J is the uh, the N four wins um, uh, three wins three out of four 13 out of uh, 13 trends beautifully right because the strategies and the t2 the slingshot is a solid robust trend following strategies uh, strategy and of course you need to be trading with the trend so you can just as easily do it and as or most of my members members do let me get this out right uh, with the trend manually and that's what it's really designed for but however this is coded as a robot so it works brilliantly also um, here uh, this is Robert uh, my first uh, my first to be in the morning 40 seconds made 200 yes I can yes I can that gets back to the chant of my members now a couple of these are coaching members however it doesn't matter because it's all taught in now just on the coaching by the way um, I run a coaching program every month eight live sessions for uh, 495 for the first or 497 for the first month then uh, 197 a month thereafter if you choose to do my coaching you don't have to do my coaching okay it's all everything's recorded however if you're looking at going live within a month or so uh, to invest a further 497 and do my coaching program uh, will make it probably a massive difference to, to most traders where we go over hundreds of trades but start with my standard program and go from there now we're about to go to the charts but this is from yesterday's coaching session and we're about to start the new session uh, um, next week in February and you can join any time and if you join mid mid month through a session you actually get to finish that month and you get the whole next month as well but um, uh, con uh, thanks Rave, great coaching um, see you next month so what actually happens traders I've got now a couple of dozen members that do it every month because we do it from 6 to 8 p.m. Eastern so it doesn't interfere with most of them with their trading but so they keep their rather full-time traders keep the skill set razor sharp and for those that are about to go professional it just makes a big difference um, th so much back for February so you just see time and this is only a quick snapshot I've removed their right uh, their email addresses are normally shown uh, now where I've got uh, Denzel uh, said I've changed he, he actually has resigned from his job he goes full-time next month learned a lot was worth a hundred times the cost uh, uh, you're welcome Robert because I know Robert will probably see see this and once again you don't have to get the coaching and this is not meant to be a big sales thing but the bottom line is this what it's about the strategies work traders the strategies work so let's go to the charts now what we're going to do and uh, uh, let's see here uh, where do we start look let's start on the ES I want to start to um, just give you some ideas here now once again traders I'm not going to give away all the secret sauce okay <laughs> raise baby right um, uh, whatever it was the baby was it anyway for <laughs> a source but um, what I'm going to just quickly do is just share a couple of ideas with you and let's just start with here so this is um, so you can look at your own charts we're looking at a at a Renko chart here now it does this, these strategies work on Renko tick time-based charts I do prefer Renko tick or range personally time-based charts with the big candles that you get you can give away a, a big part of a move can be over but if you prefer time-based charts sure it's, the strategies work just as well so let me start to give you a few hints so as I said I'm not going to give you everything but I'll give you some really good ideas okay now first of all you if you're a pure price action trader you don't need these indicators down the bottom here I love divergence you do or ideally if you're going to trade the slingshot you really want to have a stochastic uh, if you like divergence I've got a very short custom short-term custom MACD that's what this is and this is a stochastic and I trade them a certain way and it works brilliantly uh, but if you like pure price action you can trade just pure price action what I'd recommend though you do have and use the EMAs we use those for trend direction but let me start to just give you a couple of um, uh, some some feedback on some of these now so this is the ES from 9:45 a.m. on the uh, 31st of January 2019 now up here you actually had what we call a 2d that was a failure okay uh, two four five oh no you actually you would have picked up five ticks that would have been if and just very quickly some ground rules on it you're in on the third brick I call them candles and I know the 
um, of their bricks technically being Renko uh, but if there was tick or whatever okay we're either way we're in on the third candle this white paint bar is called my super scalper now that doesn't um, plot until I get an uptick uh, above the second candle or below the second candle okay so let me just declare that it doesn't appear till then now the two D's my t19s the 1d's the 2d's they're all coded okay so we, we code them just to make it easy so we're not repeating huge names all the time these are our divergence trades all right and um, uh, some are much more accurate than others now this 2d here you would have been able to scalp out our target by the way would have been as a minimum the th the 34 EMA now I'll tell you that's a 34 and we have a saying it's called follow the gold so you want to follow the gold 34 EMA uh, so you could have scalped that and um, I put that down as a loss or a small break even whatever but it did hit plus six ticks and what was that target I was talking to you about before four five by five four by five etc okay so there's a there's a scalp now uh, I have to declare this what can go wrong or what so let me with the skeptics okay uh, the only thing where this won't work these setups I'm about to show you, is if the market is flying okay really pumping you can't get your order in even with the market or you're getting massive slippage and that's with the two B's the beauty of the two B's is because he usually extended moves you can really get uh, even if you've got a couple of ticks three or four even three or four ticks slippage you still can do really well with them okay uh, so if the market is moving and this is the only reason these these setups won't work if it's really pumping you need to trade a higher time frame or set it out I don't trade news I want to sit out when we've got a, a news announcement okay if the markets pumping just sit it out okay now also uh, on platforms nearly every platform there has Renko for MT4 if you're an MT4 trader you may need to buy a, a plug-in and I've got on my website a vendor for about a $50 I think it is you can buy Renko and a range plug-in for MT4 that will plot so you can plot basically exactly the same uh, type uh, Renko but you can do this on on range as I said and also tick and I'm going to show you some tick charts in a moment very quickly so uh, scalp winner now these are all 100% almost 100% entries um, there's nothing for you to really have to guess here except do I have a trend and very important I'm only interested in trending markets okay so that's very important so scalp winner uh, this is a, a beautiful 2d some nice divergence likewise we get great divergence if you, the majority of 2b's if they're going to fail okay for an example on CL today we had three 2Bs that failed all after a 2D. Now, a 2D is really the, the climax of a run, at least in the short term. But all three then turned into a T4. Now, this is the ES we're looking at, not CL. So you may hear me say we're turning a losing trade into a winning trade because nearly all of them turn into a T4, which is a nice trade. So uh, and just very quickly where does my stop go I like to have my stop one tick below or you can use a stop under an ATR or under a parabolic and in my program I go very extensively about targets and trailing and things like that okay now but let's get back to this okay so um, if we had have entered this mechanically and I may I, I probably would have taken that one there and I would have been stopped on that trade because it only ticked up four ticks I'm really after with a 2b I'm after five as a bare minimum to go to break even that would have been a stop out for me then I've got another 2b thank you very much thank you very much now there are two for that one I still would have been in when I had this one and what about and just while we've got this what about adding to an existing position with 2b's yes if you're already under your 2% so let's just say you're trading with a 1% risk uh, there's nothing wrong with adding another contract or another lot of contracts providing you're obeying your risk management rules of a maximum of 2% risk we rally up we then have a have a great 2d pivot bounce thank you very much we then form a 3d which is an absolute kick butt setup that we get once or twice a day per market it works really well 
um, uh, and it's a pivot bounce so those that understand pivots just know uh, have how just it just increases your probabilities through the roof uh, we come on down here's a 2b again now there you would have actually uh, been able to scalp and one of the things with these 2b's is that if we get one uh, one of the uh, things to really consider and this is even for members do I have room for my entry to the 34 the further away from the 34 you are the more likely you are to profit so notice here we're right on the 34 and that fails now with this one you've actually got some distance from your entry to the 34 and that makes a big difference on your two B's it turns into a t4 as we see all the time and by the way for members watching this that t4 is nothing more usually than a t10 or a t2 a slingshot that's what it usually is we come down we've now got a 2 3 B thank you very much which turns in the market is rolling into another 2 B thank you very much we come on down now on the anchor chart and this is where it gets interesting we're looking at anchor charts so traders the anchor chart setup that I have I've got two higher time frames so this makes it a lot easier if you've got two screens at least so uh, let me show you how I uh, let's see it's on another screen but let me show you how I have it set up on CL for an example on CL I've got uh, my highest time frame and then uh, a lower time frame so I have three time frames on CL that I'm trading I'm trading a full Renko and I'm trading uh, my anchor charts are a 7 and a 12 okay so what I'm looking at doing traders whether it be the ES uh, uh, whether it be gold it really doesn't matter which market it is I'm looking at trading in the direction of the overall market trend now of course one of the things that you can do um, and in this case with uh, with the time frame I can drop a 535 EMA in and that will give me the overall direction of my anchor chart one so that tells me overall the bias is towards the long side with the market okay that's what it's giving me the overall bias so I then get um, this was actually a two beat of a long side nice little winner nice little winner that doesn't look like much by the way traders but each one of these little bricks these step ups is worth two ticks so five ticks is 6250 six ticks is 75 per contract now remember you're in basically by the close of a third candle so uh, two four six eight it ticked up uh, so it, um, here two four it only ticked up five ticks on that one but there's also something else about this here right now do I have a fanning of the EMAs am I in a sweet spot we call it the sweet spot absolutely not look at my EMAs they're horizontal do I have a trend absolutely not however with experience you still know you to trade in the direction and to take your two B's but this is the high risk area when we start the fan out we start to get okay better quality and so the fanning of the EMAs and we're getting towards the end of a trading day um, so it becomes a more, little more challenging and by the way let me just show you this here this is what we call a 200 overshoot kicks butt big time okay and if previously and it's funny I've got that there when you see these one of the first things I do is to drop on my charts my 535 now the 535 EMA work only works on certain time frames otherwise you got to lengthen or shorten the time frame to make it work but notice here the 535 this uh, uh, bounce hits the 535 to the T and this is what we call a 200 EMA overshoot and normally you'd look at this and say do I have any divergence would I take this well, you bet you do it's a 200 EMA overshoot bouncing off the higher time frame um, all right just moving along because we're running out of time because I want to go to CL and then we a little bit further along okay that was a stop stopped out but then great winner and for exits let's just quickly talk exits you can use what we call the blue trigger line here the blue line you can use uh, here I've got a um, uh, an ATR stop and flip you can wait till that flips you can wait until your first reversal candle so I teach you the different exit strategies uh, if you're a scalper like me 
where I want to get out with eight six that's I'm just a scalper right and, and if you're in my coaching class you'd hear me talk about this all the time I've got to really uh, start letting my trades run but scalping works for me like here scalp scalp now eight ticks there you got to remember eight ticks is a hundred dollars per contract what are we after okay and what I haven't pointed out is the t2s I'll quickly talk about that in a moment but these are all three B's and you can just see here we just kick butt nearly all day with them now let's talk about right now so we're now in the globex session now the globex session can be very very choppy now here I've got a three tick Renko during a globex session you can drop down to uh, probably a two where it's very very slow but as you get to learn this market and learn how to trade these um, uh, you can still do extremely well and remember earlier I said you could actually trade two markets well you could focus on and what I highly recommend you do is you really whoops and that is a 2b not a 2d right what I recommend you do initially is to focus just on the two the 2b the 3b is very closely it's basically the same thing but just a different rule applied to it okay so because it kicks butt all right and it's and another huge thing remember earlier I said the only issue with this setup is speed because the 2b is a deeper pullback okay our slingshots which I mentioned which kicks butt to the slingshot and the 34 B's a shallower pullbacks usually your two B's are a deeper pullback and when you understand the rules get ready get set go so once you understand the rules you say to yourself when condition one get ready get set go and that's very important for trading that you learn rules based strategies very important now if we look at this here uh, very very quickly we've got a, a, a plain vanilla every day of the, the week t19 here and what's a t19 a t19 whoops I just is, is a classic divergence trade okay high high lower high look at that there just just a sweet a really sweet one okay this is another 200 overshoot remember I mentioned they kick butt there it is there and it turned into a 2b again right then that turned into a 2d to the long side but here now we're mid-afternoon during the globex session so it's time to really sit this out that's what I'd sort of recommend to sit out until the open of uh, usually about uh, 8 a.m. London time which is about 6 p.m. my time 5 p.m. 6 p.m. the market really starts to pick up as we lead into London and um, so at the moment we're uh, what is it there so what is what's the time there um, let me just get this up and I'll just tell you the time uh, it is uh, 11 uh, it's uh, 23 24 Eastern Standard Time there so it's getting close to midnight most traders you'll be off to bed anyway the reason I say most traders are uh, 95% of my trade oh actually it's 90% are US based all right let's have a look at CL now I want to show you the CL and CL black gold uh, is another great market um, with on volume if you're a new trader with volume uh, CL typically turns over about six seven hundred thousand contracts a day where um, uh, the ES typically turns over one and a half to two million contracts a day uh, the NQ the NASDAQ is about five hundred thousand a day and of course then you've got the um, the financials the other markets and, and of course Forex and whatever as I said this works great uh, you can use a full range on Forex if you're a Forex trader uh, or you might go for an 89 tick of course you don't uh, volume candles are great on most markets you don't have volume unfortunately on Forex uh, and they work exactly the same on stocks so let me just be very quick here so we can keep this video under an hour what we're looking this is the open of a globex session yesterday so I'm about to show you full 24 hours very slow now I've, I'm looking at here on CL a four tick Renko which means each one of these bricks is worth $40 each one of these hash marks where it comes down is worth $20 or two ticks so it's very very slow so the four range I got the four the four tick uh, 
or point I can use very comfortably during the New York session and really 24 hours but once you get into the Globex session uh, it really slows down so I still might use the sorry about my squeaking chair there uh, um, sorry I've got a standing desk so I'm standing at my desk now <laughs> um, so uh, was about to say so during the globex session you might want to drop down to a two and that's one of the things here is that what I'm actually doing during the globex session I'm, I'm toggling between my Renko and my tick charts so and I'll show you that in a moment I'll just get a little further over here then I'll show you how I do that just to give you a couple of ideas so very slow so during the Globex session I like on CL an 89 tick and, a, and during New York I like a 233 tick All right so my anchor chart and if I'm trading the 233 tick which is my favorite tick chart to trade during New York I use an anchor chart of 610 my anchor chart on the 89 tick if I am trading off the 89 tick chart is a 233 tick the fib numbers they don't have to be um, I, I converted to, to fib numbers a few years ago just because most of thousands of my members use them so I just thought I'd jump on board but anyway that's a conversation for another time so we rally up we get a nice so it's very slow t19 nice double top these are all very mechanical entries by the way uh, we then form a 2b as the market roll so it's just a typical pattern okay now what I'm looking at here traders as the market starts to roll I'm looking at a 7 and a 12 Renko that's what I'm looking at okay so I've got a 7 and, and a 12 that's the time period so they're my anchor charts my higher time frames the market starts to roll I'm looking for all trades in the direction of the trend um, and I'm just going to scroll across here quickly so we can get through a lot okay this comes down here and if you're new to CL or maybe you, you do trade CL and you'd like a couple of quick tips a couple of quick tips CL bounce, um, bounces really well of course off round numbers 54 so we get a great bounce here at the 54 a barrel 20 cent and 80 cent levels these sort of key levels besides my pivots okay so the pivots you get a lot of pivot bounces <coughs> pardon me so what we can see here this extension this is what we traditionally call a t3 <coughs> no divergence but a real fast move no divergence on the entry but we have divergence on an anchor chart just a, a very high probability trade it's also a 54 B just have to quickly have a some my coffee there there's 54 so we're bouncing off the $54 a barrel it then turns into a 2b now my target generally with a 2b is 8 to 10 ticks uh, is what you're after with your 2b's uh, you know 8 is a really good number if you're trailing like here you can see you can pick up easily 20 40 ticks now remember what's our target let's just come back to this for a moment this is really important traders that we think about this right our target here is and I'll show you it on CL is five by five so five net trades so at the end of the day after any losses of my scalp we want to walk away with five after commissions and brokerage of 220 200 is the round number with our two B's we want to walk away with at least three eight tick trades after any losses that's 400 a day that's what we're after okay so Here's our 2B. Thank you very much. And there, if you're trailing using either the ATR or the parabolic, okay, uh, uh, you're well and truly you've actually wrapped your trading up if you choose to with a 2B. Well, what if you want to keep going? What you might choose to do then is only be willing to give back so much. Another thing too is when you get to trading multiple contracts, once you hit your daily goal of say four or five hundred dollars per contract. Uh, what you can actually do then is cut down the number of contracts that you're trading so you can keep trading if you uh, pick up a couple of sweet spots you're laughing but if you have a couple of setbacks it's not major so you can just cut that back so a 2b got another great 2b now this is a 2b but when you looked at your anchor chart you were hard up against an uptrending 89 and this is where traders your anchor charts come into it so you had a very strong uptrending 89 EMA so you were selling into very very strong support now 
even if you had have taken it you can add it in if you like because you're still kicking butt anyway so you've got another uh, that's uh, two four six eight there's another eight winner that's uh, it's ten twelve whatever it is now this uh, for members watching this actually turned into a 2d thank you very much okay so we're setting new higher highs here let's keep moving now traders some of the things that he may be quite foreign that I'm saying to you if you're a new trader here's what you've got to do you've got to realize it's a little bit like learning a new language initially but you have what I call aha moments I nearly had a slide actually I had a slide uh, with a member uh, that sent me in a slide you just he, he sends it in quite regularly he just says aha meaning that ah, the light switched on now I understand now I see it all right so watch yourself talk you can do this you can learn this just be kind to yourself and give you that night yourself at 90 days you got this incredible income possibility but and here's what happens the older you become the more skeptical you become natural fact and I talk about this with my with my one-on-one -on -one coaching clients and the, and the group coaching clients you know um, some people say well, you can't teach old dogs new tricks well in psychology today there was a great article you can it just takes a bit longer right they can hold on to the information just as well it just may take them a little longer to pick the information up now what I wanted to point out here now remember our five by fives so what I've got tearing up here is slingshots and 34 B's all the and rule of ones my black dots are what we call rule of one trades okay so we're there all the way there is your five by five just in that little run there okay you you finished your trading for the day this is a 1 2 D uh, that's 20 40 60 80 one that actually touched 12 ticks now remember just because it touches doesn't mean you got filled and that turned into a trend continuation trade but right there is your five by fives yes I can let's keep um, uh, moving let's uh, have a look here just move along a bit further okay another uh, 3d that now remember we're going in from the fourth candle 20 40 60 that's seven ticks there now remember when you're trading uh, your counter trend trades you've got to be prepared for bounces a lot earlier okay your your one two three D's your best okay particularly when you're right at the pivot note here we're not quite at the pivot yet here we're at the pivot thank you very much another classic 2b rule of one okay and we've got some slingshots on the way up then we hit then we've got basically a triple top if you looked at and let me just show you this um, let me go to this here so on the uh, let's see I'll just try to show you this when I'm recording sometimes I can play a bit of havoc but you can see here on the higher time frames it's much easier to look at this sort of triple top uh, formation that you get so what in the end we're doing traders we're trading in the direction of these higher time frames now while I'm on these high time frames let me just give you another little tip see uh, my uh, my ATR here you can use once again you can use your uh, trigger line which is the blue line you can use an ATR you can use a parabolic and in my program I teach you this but when you've got your two high time frames basically confirming that downtrend we want to take every trade that we get on our entry chart in the direction of that so for an example when we roll over here okay we want that we want that we want that we're on every one of those because your higher time frame your anchor charts is screaming down okay take every one of those so you're in on a much lower time frame now uh, Robert Miner wrote an excellent book uh, some years ago now just on the power of using an anchor chart now if three time if sorry three time frame yeah three time frames is a little confusing for a newer trader and I've only really started the last six months using a, a third high time frame you can quite as easily do it just with simply two time frames right you don't have to go to three but it helps and as you go along you'll see the benefits it's sort of a more advanced strategy uh, but it's very and we've got members now only trade with the three 
okay only trade with the three time frames all right so here that was a t19 uh, pivot bounce now your t19s is your weakest move all right and that one actually failed now if you're following the trend winner 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 okay now you've got a fantastic here this is a t19 2d it was just a marginal one for my members watching it but it okay but you can see that was a nice one uh, remember back on our anchor charts we're screaming we, we call that a t8 condition by the way when you've got a t8 condition it's you're taking every with trend trade you can and it kicks but big time now this is where is every traders challenge is this okay so we're down at um, a round number and see the black line so we're at uh, 5380 level see that black line there? we're right at a at a midline pivot that blue line and our EMAs are sideways these are the areas that you need to watch and it's what we call chop every trader has the challenge in these areas what's the answer to them once you get in a chop to sit it out and wait until you get a fanning of the EMAs and we have a rule that show or some ideas that how to do that okay but you still had a there was a 2b there if you had have taken that 2b that failed it then turned into a winning t4 as I mentioned many of those nearly always you get a t4 straight after winning 2b winning 2b winning 2b these are all mechanical okay so for the skeptics watching this you know you, you don't have to become a member I don't really care it's not going to break break my bank account okay but for the traders that are really taking this in that are asking the right questions how can I use this how can I approve my current entries and very important so if you're an experienced traders he ex trader here's what I say to you don't stop what you're doing look at what I teach and you say how can I teach how can I take what Ray teaches to improve what I'm already doing what's the presupposition you can already improve what you're already doing and you once again you're not throwing the baby out with the bathwater okay very important but uh, I haven't come across too many traders yet that haven't been able to improve what they already do but like what we're already doing however <clears throat> it comes down to mindset I learn something or someone each and every day I get it <laughs> my coaching members in and actually just I've got to tell you this look just while we've been chatting here one two I've had four member four emails just since we've been chatting from members asking questions and giving me some feedback on bits and pieces and things they're doing All right just since we've been chatting here um, uh, and that's what our community is, uh, is about and um, as one member described my uh, and I've got to show you this just stay with me for one so I've got to pull this up and show you just very quickly traders this is in this is uh, my Google Drive so when you become a member and just stay with me here because this is really important okay there are literally it's probably in the thousands now, resources and research reports and indicators um, uh, new recordings and uploads is spreadsheets is Excel spreadsheets is ebooks videos is hundreds and hundreds of items here it's the it's the last stop or, or website you'll ever need to belong to uh, I mentioned here uh, the, the 2b which I'm producing new material on the 2b continually I produce new videos most weeks I've uh, got new videos we've got uh, indicators coming in for an example if you trade with NC8 one of my members need to trade a rate just yesterday uh, sent through uh, a pile of workspaces for where is it uh, NT8 here so um, uh, trader bougie uh, he's from Canada he's been a member for a long long time sent through some templates etc so in my program uh, you're getting us all of these are free they're all just included okay I don't have indicators for every platform but there's tons of stuff new member downloads stuff there for futures Forex 34b ton of research reports on how to trade for 34b which which is a good 75 85 percent like the 2b but uh, I just felt compelled to just show you that now I also want to show you why as we close why this is so important that you learn to trade with multiple time frames so this is the globex open today it's ticking along quite quietly okay first of all nice winning 2b 2468 now you will not filled with your 86 until over here 
you had another potential entry here okay and if you're under your two percent rule with both of those you could have added to that okay now up here we then had a 2b on our anchor chart one and two so let me show you this so on our anchor chart one and two which is right there that's that point there okay now there's a, a, a major uh, setup here and my members and I won't go into what it is my members will know this okay look at this here we're at the, the, the 89 and over here right this is a everyday run-of-the-mill setup now on the entry chart your lower time frame what may appear just to be a spike in the market do we trade this where you know oscillating yes or no okay is a yes screaming yes and it was bouncing off the 20 cent level on CL this comes down we then had a 2d now 2d are your are the best of the best when it comes to divergence trading the best of it and you get these great extended moves usually and I'll tell you what it is see the 89 EMA when you've got a 2d that is our target the 89 is the target um, uh, is like a magnet with your 2ds now just before we finish off I just want to show you what else I'm doing when I do this very important traders is I'm looking at the 89 and the 233 tick one of the uh, Renko charts are fantastic for smoothing out price action but one of the issues when you smooth out the price action traders is that you can also lose some valuable information for an example on the 89 tick which works brilliantly during the globe accession which we've got there so we've got great divergence and we've got a 200 overshoot and let's look at our full Renko okay which is there it's not showing us there that we've actually got divergence okay so we're missing out on some valuable information yet on the tick uh, chart there's some very very valuable information there about what is happening on our chart at that time so what you want to do over a period of time oh and just one other thing before I, is you're also looking at your two rank and I should have pointed that out. so on the two rank now we can see when we drop the time frame down we've got a nice little bit of divergence we are at the pivot level there as we can see so look I've shared it and we've gone over an hour now a bit over now I've shared a lot of information with you traders because if there is a fair bit to mastering the art okay but it's all teachable it ain't rocket science and it's about you know having your cheat sheets in front of you it's about just learning the small things getting the screen time I give you everything you need but one thing I can't give you is a discipline and the screen time okay you've got to implement that you must do that traders but you can learn this but what you've got to do is you've got to be realistic on your time frame I'd love to say to you you're going to be you know hammering this out and getting your five six hundred a day per contract in seven days uh, is that possible with the two B's with an experienced trader of course it is very right experienced traders will pick this up very quickly other traders will take longer you have what we call these aha moments so traders um, I've given you a lot of information today um, you know I could show you hundreds of testimonials now um, yes people are going to say the strategies don't work but trade you just saw trading with the trend the entries of the entries you know it ain't rocket science but anyway I'm gonna finish up here you're probably ready for bed if you're watching this in the evening uh, so thank you very much become a member traders uh, if you want to find out more about my coaching as well on my website um, it needs to be updated a little bit there's a coaching tab at the top as I mentioned it's 497 so if you are really looking at going um, full-time very very quickly you can't go wrong with the coaching but what you can do start off with my program at 197 you get everything there's nothing held back except with the coaching we just going over what's happened that day and, and step by step we go over hundreds of trades basically every day but thank you traders I uh, hope to see you as a member and uh, certainly I hope you get a lot out of this go back over it again if you you know and just, I've just got to finish on this one thing when I watch someone else's video on trading or read a book what's that one thing that might make a difference to my trading that's what I'm always thinking what I've discovered having that mindset what can I learn from this how can I use this 
has just made this massive difference this massive shift in my life in my trading and in my members trading uh, why don't you try it thanks traders bye